Alrighty everybody, welcome back to Dan in the Dirt. First and foremost, don't forget to like, share, subscribe, and comment. You guys can find me on Twitter, you can find me on Rumble, and uh, on YouTube. And uh, stay busy, stay dirty, let's get into this. So we're doing another uh, sh Netflix show review of Gamera, baby. So, uh, I've been a uh, huge Gamera fan ever since uh, I uh, was exposed to Gamera on um, Mystery Science Theater 3000 back uh, in the original seasons of it in the 90s, and I've been in love with uh, Gamera ever since then, and um, now I see he's getting uh, easily... The Keiju, I've always dreamt of getting the getting some some uh, attention, some media attention, and uh, we're going to uh, discuss the uh, the uh, Netflix animated show that uh, has come out for Gamera, and uh, <clears throat> again we'll be doing our woke rating. Um, one being the least woke, uh, you know, wo uh, woke rating from one to ten. Woke, I mean, you know, like. Uh, the, uh, the, uh, d uh, d uh, diversity, DEI crap, or the, uh, um, ESG crap, you know, any of that propaganda crap, uh, the, you know, the WEF, uh, NWO globalist propaganda crap that these companies are, uh, like, feel like they have to be slaves to, uh, so we have a score, a scoring from, uh, one, to ten for the for the woke rating, and we'll be including that in the in the review here. Um, but uh, yeah, I uh, I love the camera. He's my favorite Keiju of all time, um, and uh, you know he uh, and uh, he uh, got. I think the Gamma series got their made their first movie for those in the '60s, I think. Yeah, and, uh, and uh, but yeah, like I said. Uh, yeah, there was um, a bunch of different movies and uh, everything, and uh, so we'll right we'll segue with that right into our review here. Um, the uh, the new show uh, is gonna uh, is uh, done with a um, more of a retro styling, I want to say, like the way that it's filmed, uh, the way the animation is done, and it's just perfect the uh, the way that is done the story is also very well written um, uh, it kept true to the Gamera um, lore that is another thing all the original monsters from like the Gamera movies and stuff uh, were included um, in this first season I would love to see other Kjus and uh, like other just other creatures. If they, uh, hopefully, they'll do more for the series. Uh, even bring some of the other famous ones into the show. Uh, maybe at some point, uh, maybe like Godzilla or King Kong, or you know, um, uh, Mothra. You know, just any any of the Kjus would be a bonus to add to the show. Um, a season finale would would be like more like the last season you do of it. Not you know, not you know. Not like maybe hopefully getting some in between before this, but one idea I had uh, would would like to see is where like oh good cake the good cajus versus like the bad cajus and have the last season called uh, maybe Gamera convergence or whatever where all the K good versus bad cajus like you know uh, battle each other that would be a pretty neat see like finale season. Um, however. Uh, you know, the show overall was great. It has that retro styling, like the way, like the anime is done. Um, and, um, there, uh, so I'll go ahead and give out my Woke's, uh, Woke rating uh, of a 1. And that's being the least it could possibly be. No Wokeness in it whatsoever. If I could give it a 0, I would. Like, that's, that's how, how that part is. So, the acting is good. All uh, the the action is good. You guys are gonna if, if you don't if you ever uh, um, watch Gamera and stuff, you'll you'll appreciate the way they kept the lore. Um, uh, and uh, the uh, the uh, the story is excellent. Um, 
the like I said, the animation is done like in a retro y not like retro y is where it looks bad, but just the the art of it. It's 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 done like in a retro type like anime thing. Think of like maybe like Spriggan or Ninja Scrolls or um a Robotech, uh uh um some of the other older animes like that, uh, but it all—it was—it was—it's an excellent show. Uh, I definitely give the the show um, uh, a perfect ten, and uh, a one on the uh, on the woke scoring. And uh, if I could give it a zero, I would, because it had nothing. It was just where you could just watch it and enjoy it and not be propagandized in any way. And um, and it was—it's nice to see our buddy Gamera here, as you can see on my shirt. Is it got this? And and I've been waiting so long, and I'm hoping that they'll—they'll—they won't just do this one. They'll do more um, seasons of it. And I, I would love to see some new Gamera movies. It would be so amazing um, to get, get to get let Gamera have his shot back in the in the spotlight because. You know, uh, we've seen everything all, all redone and all these remakes of like Godzilla and King Kong and this, that, and you know, where's Gamera? We need some, we need some good, we need some more Gamera stuff. And I, I, mean, I would be willing uh, to accept uh, even um, some uh, some added stuff, like new stuff, uh, in, into the into the Gamera lore, um, or even bring in some of those other Kajus in into the storyline. But, but, some, but you know, that would be the show, or, or, and even if they decided to do some movies, too. I definitely need some merch. You know, I, I have to go online and find, like, shirts like these, but we definitely need some, like, action figures or statues. Nika could probably step up and do some stuff. would be great. And, uh, you know, uh, uh, try to, try to you know, uh, do some stuff like a Keiju line and just, you know... Uh, it would just be, it's just, it's giving me some renewed excitement, something to look forward to. The show is great, everyone. Uh, definitely, I'm going to give it a 10, you know, but that's just, you know, and, and my bias, I've already shown uh, to the Gamera, uh, the, the Gamera Keiju and his lore, and uh, but the show stuck to that, even the monsters, um, so yeah, you guys will be pleasantly surprised if you've ever, if you're like uh, a fan of the Gamera stuff, it's like the the movies and stuff like I am, uh, or even if you're a new fan, you'll appreciate what they've done with the show. It was it's excellent. I hope they keep going with the show. I'm hoping for a couple more seasons of it, and it uh, definitely would be cool to maybe see if we can get some of the other Kajus and a finale. Like I said, maybe Gamma Convergence or something would be like the cool season, like final season. But we need some in between before that. Anyway, folks, that's my review. Of, of the new uh, Netflix uh, Gamma show, it was it was absolutely perfect, folks. So, again, don't forget to like, share, subscribe, and comment. Stay busy, stay dirty. We'll see you in the next video.